I've got the plants in here. The chances of them working is that's lotto. But I put them there anyway. It's a nice looking bush. It's growing out the uh, old paper bark tree stump. So I'd have to cut the whole stump out to do it properly. But I've just stuck them in there. And who knows? They might actually grow. I've got some stuff in the front of it that's still doing okay. There's one little one, a couple little ones there that's a different plant. Oh, I'll put that one in as well. So who knows? Maybe in 10 years. But it's better than nothing. It looks so damn empty there. But that's where I had the camellia. The Deborah's playing down at the mailbox, which I don't like her to do. As people come past their coffin. That's enough at the mailbox now. It's dangerous. There's a big bird living in there. It's a noisy bird, whatever it is. See? It's trying to talk to you. Big lump on that tree, I don't know what that is. Now he's higher up. He's trying to say hello to you, look. Not she knows a wash she's got rained on. And here, it sticks out. Look at that fixed. Of course, Polly doesn't have any electrical problems. Everything that worked in this car when she was brand, well, when I first met her, still works. It's locked at the moment. But so empty without Bessie here. I put all this up here in 2005. It did look like that. And uh, I put all this up, this carpet up under there. So it's got a bit of insulation from the heat because it's only a tin roof. And of course this side here is actually uh, the back of the house. These are Bessie's old shock absorbers. Uh, she's got four new ones at the back and because they have four at the back and two at the front. So that's her old airplane meter. Uh, the one we put on is actually second hand but said to be in much better condition than this, wasn't working properly. It's causing, you can see how, how much um, soot and everything there is in there. He won't have it if his mother comes out, they're growing, they're coming good. Baby, you'd be at the front door wanting to get out. You're not allowed to leave him. Never are you. No, I can go outside, doesn't bother him. It's when you go out. He doesn't like it if his mother leaves him. No, he doesn't. Looks is cute. Come on then. Mummy's back now. It's alright, mummy came back. His fur's thickening up, isn't it? Hmm? You're getting his furry face back. What you want? What you want? Mm -hmm. Why do you have any bites for? Getting thick, and ready. So I've got um, this is covers here. And I'm trying to wash them all, but when she comes back, hopefully later this week. Um, there's a lot of them as you can see, and I have to laundry mat them, so I'll have to take the baby.
Cooting up or what? Surprise if his mother goes out. Stand there and see if we give you a hug. Yeah, put okay. you back to the camera. Hug for mummy. Big hug. Big you hug. Big hug. So Tucker. You want some Tucker, buddy? You want Tucker? You want some Tucker? What's all this Bessie stuff in here? Look at your tails thickening up. So are your Cossack pants. Aren't they? They're thickening up. Alright, now what's the problem? Gotta wash Bessie's covers.